literally when I'm Everybody, welcome back. I've got a very poorly sausage on my lap this morning. Mabel was actually sick this morning. I don't know why. Like, so I get her out of the crate in the morning, and we just have like a little cuddle in bed, and then she normally falls back to sleep for like 10, 20 minutes. And then she went to sleep, and then she woke up, and just like so, I go like, ooh, ooh, and then just threw up. And I don't know why. Like the only thing that, that I can think it could be was it must just be something that she's eaten. And obviously like yesterday we went to Pet's Corner and I got her some new treats and some new like chews and stuff. So I don't know whether it's because she had a new treat and a new chew because she had that buffalo steak one in the car that I gave her on the way back. So I think it could be that. Also like, I don't really know. So I'm just gonna keep like a really close eye on her today and hopefully see how she does. She's eating half of her breakfast. Which, I mean, in, she normally eats it all, but the past few days she has been eating, like, not all of it. But she's just going to have a little rest here now on my lap. I need to get a video edited. And then I think I'm going to take her out on a walk. Yeah, I'm going to then take her out on a walk. She's been, like, refusing to go on walks, but I think it's because it's been absolutely chucking it down and freezing outside. So she just doesn't want to go out in it, which, you know, is fair enough. I don't blame her, to be honest. But I'm going to really try and like encourage her and push her to go on a, a big, big walk today. So we'll go on a nice walk. But yeah, normally I've just been taking her to like the field every day and just throwing this blue ball. She absolutely loves this game where you throw the blue ball and she'll go and find it. And that like kind of warms her up a bit. So I might just like do that as like a bit of a warm up and then we'll go on like a proper walk. But yeah, I'm just going to spend the morning finish editing this vlog because I really need to keep on top of my editing. She's trying to make my coffee. But yes, anyway... I've actually got, I've actually got an obsession with Killian perfumes and it's really bad. Um, but they are just like the nicest perfumes ever. So this was the first one that I got, which is Love. Don't be shy, I've literally nearly used all of it. And then this was the second one that I had. This was what I got when I was in Spain, so this really reminds me of when I was in Spain. Yeah, and then this is my new one. Yeah, I'm literally like, Obsessed. Guys, my video is all edited. I'm just making the thumbnail. I don't know, I'm not gonna go with this yet. I need some more clips, but I'm just waiting for it to export. Babes ended up on the floor, <laughs> didn't you, sweet? Should we go down? Because I'm gonna make some breakfast and you need to eat the rest of yours, babes. Come on then. Right, I'm just gonna make some breakfast. I'm gonna have some cereal. Remember to take the collagen. I actually think this is what has made my hair go so thick. Because literally when I took my extensions out and my hair was blonde, it was like so thin and scraggly. But it's, once it actually grows, if it stays this thickness, it'll just be long and thick. I know, mate, you can't have this. Mm. There you are, and then Maeve's come on, she'll be taking you outside. Ooh, it's quite bright today. I think you might enjoy your walk. Go on then, toilet. Toilet time. Oops, she might want to go. Come on. Good girl. It's like she wants me to come out with her. Good girl, Maeve. Well done. To, to my breakfast while she is doing that. Mm. Guys, before I take Mabel on a walk, I'm just gonna quickly run to the shop because basically, her basically, um, 
I need to get her a proper like padded coat for going on walks because I think it is just too cold for her. Um, but basically, I'm going to get like a proper one. Um, I did actually order one on Amazon and then it never arrived and the order got cancelled. So I think I'm just going to all find like a proper nice one online. But for today, I just need to get her like a temporary one and apparently Aldi sell them for like £6. I mean, if it's any good, then I will just use that one. But I do want to get, I've seen ones where you can get like the names engraved. <laughs> so I might get one of those. But yeah, I'm just going to quickly run to Aldi now and see if they've got them because it's just like a good temporary fix and then I can take her on a walk afterwards I just don't want to take her out while it's this cold because she's just so small but yeah okay we'll go to Aldi and catch up with you in a bit <laughs> I managed to get one. Oh my god, I was literally looking through and I could only find like size large and medium and I was like they're gonna be too big but I managed to find a small I think this should fit her. It was only $7.99 so and I'm not really too bothered if it doesn't fit her. I can just return it but they did have an extra small but I thought it looked too small because like because she's got like a stuck out chest as like sausage dogs do I think she's gonna need that extra bit at the top and obviously because she's really long the extra small just looked a bit short. So anyway, we're gonna go back now and we're gonna go see if this fits Mabel and then we can take her for a walk. It's not too big, nah. Oh, I don't know, I feel like it's too big. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's way too big. I'm gonna have to go return it and get the smaller size. Guys, I got the small and it's way too big. I don't know why I I overestimated. So I'm going to go back and get the extra small because there was an extra small, but I'm just going to hope it's still there. Um, but yeah, I've got the receipt, so we'll just have to go and exchange it. Right, guys, we have the right size. This is a lot. See, this looked really small to me, but then that other one was massive, so I'm hoping this one fits her. I also think it's reversible, so you can have it as like yellow or green. Wow, mate, that's a perfect fit. <laughs> I think she likes it. She's not even trying to get it off. Normally, that's what she does when I put something new on. <laughs> Look, it's so good. Shall we take you on a walk then? Shall we go walk? Walkies? Yes, come on then. Come on. From our walk, I'll be Mabel. She's here. I need to go and post this vintage parcel where I go to post this as an MS. So I might go get some food bits. I want to get some more of them little like snacky things that I've been eating for like my lunch because they're just really easy. Oh, because I feel like recently I've just been making like breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and it's just been like a lot of cooking. Oh, you enjoy your walk, gorgeous? You're gonna stay here and have a sleep while I go get some food? Right. We are back. I literally only got 
got a few bits. So I've seen these all over TikTok. Like camembert. I don't know like, what they are, but they just look so nice. And then, I'm actually so influenced by TikTok, it's so bad. And then I've seen the viral. It's meant to be like a hazelnut latte with like, if you get the hazelnut syrup, but I'm not actually a massive fan of syrup these days. So I'm just gonna try it with those two together. And then I'm like obsessed with these Serrano ham things. So I've got three of those. Same with these better things. Um, and then of course, I got a cooked chicken, but they didn't have any half chickens, they only had the large ones, so I'm going to have like half for my lunch, and then half for tea. And then these will go in the fridge. Um, I need to hang the washing up because obviously maybe we'll sit this one. Bless her, she's actually been okay today, I've been watching her. Obviously she was fine on the walk, weren't you, May? Yes. Um... So yeah, I think you just maybe ate something bad. Or maybe you just weren't feeling well this morning, but now you're so much better. But yeah, I need to, I washed the bed in. So I need to just hang it up and hopefully it's dry by tonight because we do have a dryer. So yeah, it's really hard to dry a bed in without the dryer. But we're gonna attempt to do it. I think for lunch, I'm gonna cook some pasta. So this is like my go-to lunch. And this is why I just, it's so easy just getting a cooked chicken. Cause, I much prefer like a roast chicken and pasta. Oh my gosh, what's going on with this thing? Um, then like chicken breast. I feel like chicken breast is always like weird, like, I don't know, like chewy bits in it and it always makes me feel sick. So, I just find it so much easier getting a cooked chicken. Like it's just all done and ready. Right, so pasta. Right, that'll probably take about 14 minutes. Right, so ingredients are this mascarpone sauce. I've tried a few mascarpone sauces from different supermarkets and I have to admit Heinz is my all-time favourite because it doesn't have like bits in it. I'm actually such a child when it comes to food. Yeah, I'm quite, quite busy. And then Go with, we go for a bit of cream cheese. Mm -mm -mm. A bit more. Rest of that to lick, because she loves it. Come here, gorgeous. What's mummy got for you? Watch this. Sit. Paw. Paw. <laughs> well done, she's like lifted a paw up. But it's because I put it right in front of her. Oh, sweet. Oh, yummy. Oh, look at her little paws up. <laughs> Still up. Is that nice? Oh, well done. Well done, gorgeous. Right, so I've got the cream cheese, the sauce, and then the final ingredient is chicken. The skin on this is so nice. I'm not normally a massive fan of skin and chicken, but these M&S ones, I will eat the skin. Is that unreal? Yeah, we'll just pop the chicken in my pasta. Get all that protein in. That reminds me, I need to sign up for a gym. Now we've just moved because I really want to get back into the gym. Mm mm mm. Chicken! And there we have it. It is my 
chicken tomato pasta. Isn't it made? <laughs> right, guys. Um, I'm gonna just hide in the kitchen and give Mabel her tea. I've literally spent the afternoon just editing videos and sorting out Mabel's Instagram. Um, I said an Instagram for Mabel. I wish I did it right at the start, but I don't know. I just never made one for her right at the start, but I set one up like a couple of months ago. So I've just been like kind of updating all the pictures from like when I first got her, but I'm kind of like nearly caught up now to like where she is right now. Um, yeah, I just need to give the kitchen a quick tidy. Excuse me, Mabes. And then I will make Mabel's tea. Um, I don't know what I'm going to have for tea. This afternoon's gone so quick. Um, but I've literally just been busy. I need to sort out the bed in as well. Don't be Mabel. Okay, so Mabel's food. chicken and tripe and she always eats this well so one I gave her this morning was duck and turkey and she didn't eat it but I don't know whether that's because she was sick the lamb she's definitely gone off because the past few times I've given her lamb she's just not eating it but she loves chicken and tripe I feel like she just gets bored of like the same flavour that's why like I get her a few and then switch it up but now I feel like she's going off flavours but she loves this chicken and tripe so I'm just going to give her this all day tomorrow as well and see how she gets on because she actually eats it all. This is her slow feeder bowl that I get on Amazon. I've got an Amazon storefront where basically I have just been adding everything that I bought for Mabel right from the start when she was a puppy because I, I got all her starter bits from there like a crate, toys, shoes, absolutely everything. Um, people always ask me on like my TikTok and YouTube where I get all of her things from. So what I did is I made an Amazon storefront and I basically just like categorised everything from the start of when I got Mabel. So like puppy essentials, um, walk accessories, beds, ramps, all those kind of things. Um, and yeah, I've just put them all into categories so it's like really clear and obvious. So what I'll do actually is I'll link it in the description if I do forget someone comment and remind me and I will add it in. Then if there's anything that I've got, like I've got this on Amazon. But yeah, she's absolutely very happy. She's very good, so she's not poorly. I feel like Dashens, they have those like days where they're just like either randomly sick or like they just seem really down. Like I remember when Mabel was a puppy and I took her to the vet because she was like so down and weird. And like we took her on a walk and she was just like crying and crying. And I got, she'd only calm down if I held her. And I was like, oh my gosh, what is wrong with her? And like I took her to the vet and like, the vet bill came to like 125 pounds. And literally as soon as I took her home, she was absolutely fine. I was like running around all happy. And I was like, seriously, like, come on. Um, but yeah, oh my gosh, she's eating all of that. She's literally eating all of that. Well done. Well done, Miss Maybelline. Have you eaten all your tea? Oh, I'm really proud of you, Mabel. But yeah, so I don't really know what to do with this wall. I'm waiting until my mum gets, she's currently staying at the moment, when she comes back from holiday, I'm going to get her to come round and give me a bit of an idea. She's just got like an eye for houses. I mean, I should really as well, because I did do interior architecture and design. I mean, saying that, it wasn't actually like interior design. It was more like interior architecture than interior design. Like, it wasn't really anything to do with interior design. I did that at uni. Um, I do have a good eye for things, but I just like, 
my mum is an expert with this sort of stuff and I just feel like she she's done up houses her whole life pretty much we used to move around a lot when we were younger I'm so used to moving around like why can't I just stay in one place but yeah I'm gonna get her to give me a hand with it because I think she's gonna tell me to paint it navy the same as these cupboards and then I'm thinking I want to get you know that big arched mirror from the range my brother's got one in black but I want one in gold I'm gonna put that in the corner there but obviously I need to sort this whole wall situation out but yes oh James has got a new chair that we went and got from Pet's Corner you enjoying that Mabes? Right, I don't actually think I've got much planned for the rest of the evening. I feel like I'm just gonna have like an early night tonight. I'm gonna have a bath. Oh my God, I absolutely love having baths. Um, obviously in where I used to live in the apartment, there, was, there wasn't there was a bath. So I've literally not had a bath for like so long. Um, I literally have a bath every single night now. Like I'm obsessed. And now it's, I think my mum sent me something the other day saying that Lush have brought back the Snow Fairy shower gels and bath bombs. So I need to go to Lush at some point and get loads of like bath stuff. I did actually go the other day and got like a little trio thing, but I used them all really quickly. So I want to go and get loads more Lush stuff. But yeah, I'm probably going to close the vlog off here because I don't really have much else planned. And I'm probably just going to chill, watch TV, maybe cook some tea, um, have a bath. So I will end the vlog here. Maybe we'll say bye to everyone. Um, yeah, thank you to everyone who's watched. Please like and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I shall see you all in the next video. Mm -hmm.